So we're at the Redmond Homes Fall Show, and this is Jason Brommer, and he's going to introduce the home that we're about to go through. And Jason Brommer's position? He's the sales manager of Redmond Homes. Very nice. Thank you. We're going to first start in the Northwood L27609. It's a new floor plan we brought out. You can see this house, we did a nice little elevation on the front called the Deco Dormer Number 5. Puts two lights on each side of the door, the dormer and the cedar shakes. And this is, is this a 16, two? this is a 16 by 80, three bedroom, two bathroom. Okay, let's go in. So I've had a lot of people asking me for technical information, so if you could do that today, then that would help me. Technical information. Yeah, they want to know a lot of Robert, can you help him? with some of the questions we've been asked that I was like, I don't really know. A lot has to do with the um, insulation that the homes mm -hmm. have, the uh, exterior walls being two by six. Okay. Well, it depends on what series of home. Like Northwood's our basic, uh, one of our, our basic floor plans, our basic series, and it's our most popular series because it starts at more of a, a base level home and then people can option it up. The, Two by six side walls, R22 in the roof, R11 in the floor is standard. And you can upgrade from there to 22 in the floor, 30 in the roof. You can take it up to an Energy Star package certified home. So all those uh, goodies are available as far as. Um, and this is a this upgraded cabinet. No, this is cabinet? Uh, this is our standard cabinetry here. This is a wood door with an MDF style. And we have five different colors you can choose from. The arch, the um, the shaker style doors, as you see, come with a Euro pool. The arch top doors come with a, a normal handle. And this here, you know, this this home here is standard with all the cabinetry uh, on this side of the uh, kitchen, and it is standard cabinetry up to this cabinet here. The the desk is optional, along with the window. Oh, very nice. And something new we're doing, LED recessed can lights. Wow, very good. You can nice. buy them exchange of the standard, which there's four standard recessed can lights in a Northwood. And you can, or you can buy um, you can buy more and place them wherever you like. They are available with a dimmer switch. It's the only light that we offer out of the effort of plants that is available on a dimmer switch. It's a specific dimmer switch for an LED light. It will not work on a normal fixture. And they're much brighter. Much brighter, they're much more energy efficient. They're actually easier to install. All they do is they come with the bulbs in them. So all our guys do is drill a hole in, put the wire on and pop it up in the hole. So there's not, you know, there's not too many upgrades in this uh, in this house, since you got your ceiling fan here, we did upgrade the other light fixtures. Um, we did an appliance package, this is your ESP appliance package. And what that does, it upgrades your standard range. You keep the standard range in the standard uh, refrigerator. You get a dishwasher and a microwave for about 900 bucks. Is this bench an option? No, this is all included in the floor plan. Oh and my with word. the bench, you get a cushion. Oh Gosh. It's got the raised ledge, it's got a black drop-in sink and a single lever faucet. Okay, my people are going to love this little eating area. This is a single wide, what's the measurement? 16 by 80. Okay. Oh my word. So, um, is there anything else about the kitchen that you can tell me about that people will ask about? Is the microwave, this is all an upgraded package? The appliances, uh, with the exception of the appliances, be it meaning the microwave and the dishwasher, are upgrades. It's, a, it's our basic appliance package. Like I said, for 900 bucks, you get a dishwasher, microwave, standard range, standard refrigerator remote. We call it that the ESP package. And this range here is? That's your standard gas range. Okay. That's, that's, what we, beautiful. that's what we do. That's, that's a standard once in a while. We're having actually some shortages right now. With with is it a self-cleaning mm -hmm. oven? Self-cleaning. It is a got the timer on it. It's got wow. a clock on it. And that is a drop-in black sink. That's optional with a single lever faucet. Okay, this is good to see because now all of a sudden I've had a flurry of people interested in different kinds of sinks. Mm -hmm. This is really deep. Your standard cabinet is an MDF style versus and your door is a hardwood. And okay. you get a fixed shelf on a Northwood. Okay. Drawer bank. So much. 
cabinet space. And what's this counter? Summer Carnival. Very pretty. Pamplona Lino Tuscany Maple Shaker Cabinet. And the floor, is this a tile floor? Wow, it's beautiful. This, is this is, looks like it's tile. Yep, it's, <laughs> uh, and they've gotten, they've gotten so good with these patterns that you can look at how they stagger their joints. Yeah. It makes it look like a professional tile layer came in and did this. So do you have to have the vent in the middle like that or not? This can is you... called inline heat. Standard is inline. Okay. Optional is perimeter. Oh, that's good to, to know because yeah. people will ask me about that. That's what your inline heat looks like. We did, we optioned the linoleum right through the living room on this particular home. They give it a bigger feel when yeah. you walk through the door. Okay, people are definitely coming to us and no longer asking for carpeting in the living room. So that's important to know. Yeah. So what else can you tell me about this? Other than that, uh, we upgraded the molding package from the, the standard flat. If you see in the master bedroom, you'll be able to get a comparison of what we do different. The, Cove molding gets upgraded, the door casings get upgraded, okay. and uh, versus the flat molding. And this is the molding that matches the kitchen cabinets? Yep, correct. Oh. All, you can get white, we offer, our, our molding colors come in all flavors that our cabinetry comes in. Very nice. That's not your words. All right, let's take a look at the, is this the master bedroom this way? Yeah. So we have never selected wallpaper and this looks really pretty. This is very impressive. Oh my word. Check out this gorgeous bathroom. It's like a spa retreat. Oh my goodness. The floor is beautiful. And I've never picked out that countertop. That looks really lovely. I usually do contrasting but this monochromatic is really pretty the medicine cabinet is interesting that it's on both sides here's that same transom little window above the bathtub this here you got an optional in cabinet all right very nice here. you got what we call a two-door reflections cabinet and it's two door, one, two, mirror in the middle, recess lights above it, exchanges a standard uh, mirror and the standard tulip light above the sink. People will Porcelain love sink. this. This is their standard faucet. Okay. Standard backsplash. So the only upgrade is the mirror and the lights? Mm-hmm. And the linen cabinet. And the, so. Okay. Very nice. And the transoms and the tub over drape. That's so also. You're standing over right there. Wow, it looks like a spa. We did the bypass sliding closet doors. I love those. those we love those. They give you, you know, more room savers. in here. Really nice. So this bath, master bath bedroom has two closets. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Separate closets and uh, with two bifold doors. And you did um, carpeting in here. Mm -hmm. Standard. Okay. Wow, that's pretty. All right, so here's the view from your master bedroom to this beautiful kitchen and living room. Really, really impressive. Wow, this is really handsome. And they did this kind of accent wall with a different color paper than the rest of the house. I, I might be bold enough next time to order the paper. You guys make it look so pretty. All right, here's the first bedroom. We get a gal, uh, she's from the South, Maybe she just started working with her last year. And this is the closet. We'll just take a look at the room from this angle. And then we'll take a look at the second bedroom. I don't know if in our communities we have um, a spot big enough for an 80 foot. That seems kind of long for us. And then here is the other bathroom. Wow, look at that. That looks really awesome with the red, the red wall. I really like that. Let's see. This floor is really pretty. I'm going to try and use this. And is this little window extra? Yep. That window is optional, this window is optional. The floor plan pretty much indicates all the optional areas where there's um, different available options. Mm -hmm. So do you have a, um, 
Anything else you can tell me about the furnace? A lot of uh, people ask about just that. your typical 086 gas furnace, which is standard in all of our houses. And the only upgrade here in the north would you have to upgrade to a metal furnace door. What's typically there? An opening. Okay. Yep, they put an opening there. It's. I don't think our people know that's an option because we always pay for that. Yes, correct. Yeah. yeah. There's a lot of things that Mr. Dolan adds to above and beyond the correct. standard. We have a that standard spec sheet that we follow that upgrades you know your single wise to a certain level okay so most people that come to us are impressed by central air conditioning and the hot air uh forced hot air i don't know what happened in the history of the industry but why is that so impressive to people i have no idea would you be able to speak to that robert no it's always been a hot air system um i think what's happened over time is a lot of the communities have gotten away from oil Okay. And have converted over to natural gas, which ends up being less expensive to operate a natural gas furnace than oil. Okay, so um, that that's why people, yeah. they have a thought in their mind, a preconceived notion about the older ways of doing it, propane right. gas and oil tanks. Right. And right. now we're offering what a normal house would have. Right. Yep. And these uh, furnaces make it real easy for on-site installation in an AC unit. There's a, a part, compartment there. On site, there gets an A coil, runs it out to the outside unit, and you're set to go. Guy can be in and out of there in a day. Yep. Very nice. Anything else you need to tell me about any of the rooms? Take a look at the, you know, if you notice, we try anywhere we can if the home allows for it. We'll try and do a 36 inch interior oh, yeah. wherever possible. I've right. had people if request you notice, that. Our standard doors, our only door we offer is an arch top door, a two panel arch top door. Which is door. so elegant. Yep. Yeah. It, it really is. Nice really All the doors were like that. Very pretty. Anything else about this house? No, this is pretty much wraps it up. So we would probably never be able to do an 80-foot house for our communities. Right. That's our a little too long. We would not be able to take an 80-foot house, but we can take this um, series of house, and we can design it the way that it would fit on our sites. So this home has a lot of options in it, a lot of great things that we can put in any other series of home that would accommodate this house. It's um, really worth looking at. Here's the floor plan. I mean, you could even uh, do one bedroom and just do the first part and then leave out the bedrooms, the second bedrooms, because of a lot of our seniors like, would probably <coughs> like this feature. Yes. All right, thanks for touring us through this gorgeous house. Thank right. you.